If you're new to York, you may well find yourself on one of the many tours that operate around our historic city centre. Who better to provide said tour than history buffs from the York Civic Trust? We caught up with them at their stall in the city centre. Well, the Civic Society has been here for something like 70 years, and this is probably the first time that we've taken such a prominent position in York to, ex to explain to York, and uh, our York citizens in particular, what we actually do, what we're about, and what contribution we make to the fabric and the cultural life of York. So what we've got here is the displays of our principal activities, and that's what you've seen behind me. And it's to do with the things on the side of buildings, plaques, figures, and so on. And if you look around York and enjoy York and look around you, much of what you see wouldn't have been there if it wasn't for the York Civic Trust or people like us that have campaigned for its preservation and indeed often are not funding its uh, renovation. So here we are, we're here today to actually explain to the people of York what we do and hopefully get more of them to become engaged and indeed uh, join us in our campaigns. The tours were free and very popular. They were run by experts on the city's history, like Dr Jane Grenville. So I'm hoping that you can all hear me, but if you can't, wave your arms about. Um, so what we're going to do is just start here. I said we'd start with the Romans and we will. And, and one of the things that the Civic Trust did uh, was to campaign very vigorously uh, against shopping developments which suck the lifeblood out of the city centre. So uh, any, any thoughts about that building? Oh, variety hall. A variety hall? Any other thoughts? Chapel? It's a chapel. chapel. It's a terrestrial yeah. window. It, it is. It is a chapel. Other volunteers ran the stall, like the Trust's oldest member, Jerry Webb. The Civic Trust is of great importance to York. I think without the Civic Trust, York would not be the city it is today. It, it is so important to make sure that we maintain our heritage. Have you any plans to slow down soon? I think you're, you're one of the oldest members of the York Civic Trust. I think Party. probably at the age of 91, I think I probably am, yes. Yeah. <laughs> but you're going to keep going and keep telling uh, people about yes, the history of York? It's, uh, <laughs> it's such a worthwhile job and there's so much still to learn. A very impressive Jerry Webb there. If he can keep going, there is hope for all of us. Matthew Brannan, That's TV.